So what we have in this problem is an Argentinosaurus and this animal was found in Argentina almost 97 million years ago. And this is a huge animal. It can grow to almost 25 meters and it has a huge heart which can weigh up to 150 kilograms. So the question here is that you have an Argentinosaurus which is about 21 meters in height and its heart is at a level of 9 meters above the ground. So if the pressure at the brain level is 1.066 into 10 to the power 3 pascals, then what pressure should be generated by the heart so that the brain gets this much pressure so that the Argentinosaurus can kind of roam freely and do whatever it needs to do to live. So the equation we'll use is that the pressure at the heart level should equal to the pressure at the brain level plus the pressure due to the blood column between the brain and the heart which we know can be written as the density of blood into g into the distance between the brain and the heart and let's say that it is h so once we have this equation it becomes easy we know that the pressure at the brain is 1.066 into 10 to the power 3 pascals plus the density of blood is given as 1.06 into 10 to the power 3 kilogram per meter cube into g which is 9.8 and we know that the height or the distance between the heart and the brain is nothing but 21 minus 9 meters and when you solve for this what you find is that this equals 135.3 into 10 to the power 3 pascals so the heart needs to produce a pressure of 135.3 into 10 to the power 3 pascals so that the blood can get pumped up to the brain level and create a pressure of 1.066 into 10 to the power 3 pascals. So the second question is that if this is the pressure produced by the heart, then what is the pressure at the feet of the Argentinosaurus? So this again becomes pretty easy and the equation we'll use is that PF or the pressure at the foot of the Argentinosaurus is equal to pressure at the brain level let us say plus the pressure due to the blood column between the brain and the foot and we can write this again as the density of blood into G into the distance between the brain and the foot which let's say is H tire. So we'll go ahead and write the pressure at the brain level as 1.066 into 10 to the power 3 pascals plus density of blood is 1.06 into 10 to the power 3 kilogram per meter cube into g which is 9.8 into the height which we know is 21 meters and when you solve what you find is that the pressure comes to 228 into 10 to the power 3 pascals or when the heart has a blood pressure or the heart produces a blood pressure of 135.3 into 10 to the power 3 pascals, the pressure at the foot would be 228 into 10 to the power 3 pascals. So if you like this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to the Science Cube.